at UFC 224. Nunes and Pennington will light up Rio de Janeiro as they take center stage for a championship showdown. She has a knack of winning fights in spectacular fashion. It's for the number one spot in the world. You know, whoever wins this fight is the number one female bantamweight in the world. More punishment. What a dominant victory by Amanda Nunes. For Amanda, it's leaving a legacy, and, and you're trying to be the greatest female fighter that ever lived. Stay more Nightmare coming. The Nigerian Nightmare is looking for you, and I'm going to find you. With 11 straight wins in his wake, and he's ready to make Maya number 12. But the king of grapplers isn't scared. Damian Maya by submission! Maya. He's defeated vicious competitors before. Damian Maya! And he's ready to do it again. UFC Fight Night, Saturday at 10 Eastern on FS1. Two of the biggest personalities in MMA. I make the predictions and I make them wrong. Now host the best podcast in the sport. I'm the first guest. <laughs> We're not going to mention the eight fighters that said no. UFC Unfiltered with Jim Norton and Matt Serra brings you the latest in fight news and analysis, behind the scenes stories, pop culture debates, celebrity guests, and more. We have The Rock calling in. How are you, man? I just want to see a great fight. <laughs> Hear new episodes every Tuesday and Thursday on iTunes, Google Play, Spotify, and UFC.com. UFC Unfiltered. Saturday on FX. Before Nunes defends her belt against Pennington, Cesar Fajera battles the unbeaten Carl Robertson. This kid has to learn some respect. UFC 224 prelims. Saturday, 7 Eastern on FX. UFC fans, we'd like to welcome you to the weigh-in for UFC 224, Nunes versus Pennington. Tomorrow night, it is a Brazilian homecoming for UFC women's bantamweight champion, Amanda Nunes, as she puts her belt on the line once again, opposite American challenger, Raquel Pennington. Also on tap in the co-main event, massive stakes in the UFC's middleweight division, as Shaka de Souza fights in Rio for the first time against fellow contender, Kelvin Gastelum. We would like to thank our UFC sponsors, Serpa x Porch, Sosa Lima, and Volkswagen Amarok. We would also like to send a special welcome to our UFC Fight Club members joining us today here in Rio de Janeiro. We hope to see all of you once again for the live action tomorrow night. And now, ladies and gentlemen, we present the weigh-in for UFC 224. Aqui estão as nossas Octagon Girls, Camila Oliveira, Jenny Andrade, Luciana Andrade, Sean Shelby, matchmaker do UFC, Dave Shaw, vice-presidente de relações internacionais do UFC. Vamos começar agora a cerimônia de pesagem do UFC 224, Nunes vs Pennington. Você acompanha amanhã. Vamos lá. Luta que você também acompanha no UFC Fight Pass, divisão dos médios, Middleweight Division, James Baknovic e Marcos Pérez. O primeiro aqui na balança, Mr. James Baknovic. Official weight is 186, 84.4 kilos, 84 kilos e 400 gramas para James Waknovic. Senhoras e senhores, recebam o seu adversário, Marcos Maluco Pérez.
the official weight is 186, 84.4 kilos, 84 kilos and 400 grams for Marcos Maluco. Vamos para a pesagem na próxima luta. Divisão dos meio-médios. Welter Weight Division. Vem aí, Ramazan MF e Alberto Mina. O primeiro aqui na balança, Mr. Ramazan Corex MF. Official weight is 171, 77.6 kilos, 77 kilos e 600 gramas para Ramazan Imad. Vem aí o seu adversário, Alberto, Soldier of God, Mina! The official weight is 171, 77.6 kilos, 77 kilos e 600 gramas para Alberto Minar. Pesagem na próxima luta que você também acompanha no UFC Fight Pass. Divisão dos médios, middleweight division, Jack Hermanson e Thales Leites. The first on the scale is Mr. Jack the Joker Hermanson. Official weight is 186, 84.4 kilos, 84 kilos e 400 gramas para Jack Hermanson. Galera, vamos receber Mr. Thales Leites! The official weight is 186, 84.4 kilos, 84 kilos and 400 grams for Thales Leites. Pesagem na divisão dos meio-médios, o Welterweight Division. Você também acompanha no UFC Fight Pass. Sultan Aliyev, Warley Alves. O primeiro aqui na balança é o Mr. Sultan Aliyev. Official weight is 171, 77.6 kilos para Sultan Ali. Vem aí o seu adversário. Senhoras e senhores, recebam o Ale.
The official weight is 171. 77.6 kilos para Wally Alves. Na próxima luta do card preliminar, divisão dos meio médios, Welter Weight Division, Sean Strickland contra Eliseu Capoeira. O primeiro aqui na balança é o Mr. Sean Tarzan Strickland. The official weight is 170, 77.1 kilos para Sean Strickland. E vem aí o seu adversário and his opponent, Eliseu Capoeira. The official weight is 171, 77.6 kilos, 77 kilos e 600 gramas para Eliseu Zaleski, Eliseu Capoeira. Pesadinha agora na divisão dos leves, Lightweight Division, Nick High contra Davi Ramos. The first on the scale is Mr. Nick Hine. The official weight is 155, 70.3 kilos, 70 kilos e 300 gramas para Nick High. Senhoras e senhores, vamos receber Davi Ramos! The official weight is 156, 70.8 kilos, 70 kilos e 800 gramas para Davi Ramos. Ainda no card preliminar, vamos à pesagem na categoria peso pesado, Heavy Weight Division. Junior Albini contra Alexei Olenik. O primeiro aqui na balança, senhoras e senhores, é o Mr. Junior Baby Albini. The official weight is... 266 pounds, 120.7 kilos, 120 kilos e 700 gramas para Junior Albini e o seu adversário and his opponent, Mr. Alexei Olini. The official weight is 235 pounds, 
106.6 kilos, 106 kilos y 600 gramos para Alexei Olenik. Vamos para a pesagem da última luta do card preliminar, divisão dos médios, middleweight division. Vamos se enfrentar Carl Robertson e César Mutante, the first on the scale is Mr. Carl Baby K. The official weight is 185, 83.9 kilos. 83 kilos e 900 gramas para Carl Robertson. E vem aí, César Ferreira Mutante! The official weight is 186, 84.4 kilos, 84 kilos e 400 gramas para César Mutante. Vamos para a pesagem das lutas do card principal, vamos começar com duas lendas do MMA, duas lendas do UFC, divisão dos médios, middle, a division, Lioto Matida contra Vitor Belfort, the first on the scale, o primeiro aqui na balança é Lioto the Dragon The official weight is 186, 84.4 kilos, 84 kilos and 400 grams for Lioto, the Dragon Matida. And come here, ladies and gentlemen, Victor the Fino. The official weight is 184, 83.5 kilos, 83 kilos e 500 gramas para Vitor, the Phenom Belfort. Pesagem da próxima luta do card principal, categoria peso galo, Benton, Weight Division, Brian Kelleher e John Lineker. The first on the scale is Mr. Brian Boom The official weight is 136, 61.7 kilos, 61 kilos e 700 gramas para Brian Keller. E vem aí o seu adversário and his opponent, Mr. John Hands of Stone Lineker. The official weight is 136, 61.7 kilos, 61 kilos e 700 gramas para John, Hands of Stone, Lineker.
Mesagem da próxima luta, as meninas vão se enfrentar na categoria peso palha. Women's Strawway Division, Amanda Cooper e Mackenzie Turn. The first in the scale is Miss Amanda ABC Cooper. The official weight is 116, 52.6 kilos, 52 e 600 para Amanda Cooper. E vem aí a sua adversária and her opponent, Miss Mackenzie Jones. The official weight is 123, 55.8 kilos, 55 e 800. Mackenzie Dern passou 3 kilos e 200 gramas do limite da categoria. Ela cede 30% da bolsa a que tem direito a sua adversária Amanda Cooper. Vamos à pesagem da penúltima luta, the co-main event of the evening. Divisão dos médios, middle, way division, Kelvin Gasolin contra Ronaldo Jacaré. O primeiro aqui na balança é o Mr. Kelvin Gasolin. The official weight is 185, 83.9 kilos, 83 kilos e 900 gramas para Kelvin Gastelum. Galera, vamos receber agora ele, o Ronaldo Jacaré. The official weight is 186, 84.4 kilos, 84 kilos e 400 gramas para Ronaldo Jacaré. Senhoras e senhores, vamos agora conferir um pouquinho da história das duas atletas que farão a luta principal do UFC 224. Raquel Pennington e Amanda Nunes. De olho na tela. I can't wait for that moment. Walk to the cage in my country. That is going to be an unbelievable moment. And I'm going to walk away with my belt. The woman who retired Ronda Rousey is fighting the woman who retired Misha Tate. That tells you how good these ladies are. That shows you how dynamic they are, how aggressive they are, how good their finishing is, how good their striking is. Amanda Nunez is the lion at 135. When you see what she does with her hands, the combinations, the power, the aggression, that's rare in any weight class. The way she beats fighters up and silences the crowd, now this is my octagon. No one's gonna come in here and take my title. Nunes poured it on, plenty of time here. She's got the choke, she's got the choke. People's gonna see a uh, way better jumping Amanda Nunes than before. I'm gonna jump here, Amanda Nunes! Raquel Pennington has been under the radar to a lot of fans until this title fight. There's a certain strength in that. When you don't think about a fighter, when you overlook a fighter, that's when they're at their best. You're never stronger than when your opponents think you're weak. She doesn't really know what to expect. Where I'm at mentally, I feel like that's a very dangerous thing alone. 
I chased this dream for so long in my career, and finally I got here. And I will keep proving I'm the best thing ever. There's the towel, there it is. She has what I want, and she's obviously going to try to keep what she has. Oh, that is close, that is close. She made it, she's out, she's out. Oh, my she's goodness. out cold. As soon as that fight's said and done, I see my hand being raised. I feel like when you're determined to get something, and nothing's going to stop you, that's why I have the belt. Whatever she showed me, I'm gonna capitalize. And still. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the challenger, Raquel Uraki Pennington! The official weight is 135, 61.2 kilos, 61 kilos e 200 gramas para Raquel Pennington. E agora vamos receber a atual campeã mundial na categoria peso galo, the Women's Pantaloon Championship of the World, Amanda. The official weight is 135, 61.2 kilos, 61 kilos e 200 gramas para Amanda Nunes. Raquel, good luck for you tomorrow. Como é que você acha que você pode vencer a Amanda Nunes e se tornar a nova campeã mundial amanhã à noite? How do you think you can beat Amanda Nunes and how are you going to become the champion tomorrow night? You know what, I'm just going to go out there, I'm going to have some fun and uh, I'm going to be the best Rocky. Eu vou lá e amanhã eu vou me divertir, eu vou ser a melhor Rocky que eu posso ser. Good luck. Amanda. Oh, my love, I'm sorry. Raquel Pennington. The Lioness. Sua estreia no UFC foi aqui no Rio de Janeiro. Quase cinco anos depois, sua estreia no UFC foi aqui no Rio de Janeiro. Quase cinco anos depois, você está de volta e para fazer a sua, a sua terceira defesa do título mundial. O que, é que passa pela sua cabeça nesse momento? O que, é que passa pelo seu coração nesse momento? You debuted in the UFC here in Rio almost five years ago, and now it's your third belt defense here in Rio. What are you thinking right now? Só tenho uma coisa a dizer a vocês. Muito obrigada pela presença de cada um. E essa cinta fica. Essa cinta fica aqui no Brasil com a gente. Pode ter certeza disso. Only have one thing to say. Thanks everyone for coming out and the belt staying here in Brazil. Amanda Nunes, senhoras e senhores. O UFC 224 você acompanha amanhã também no UFC Fight Pass, no Pay Per View, no combate. Um abraço, obrigado. Valeu. Nights of the year in sports, live inside a sold-out Chunas Arena in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. She is the most prolific finisher in the UFC women's bantamweight division. Brazil! I'm the champion here, Amanda Nunes! From one Brazilian MMA icon to another. This guy's scary on the feet, not just on the ground. The Brazilian jiu-jitsu legend, Chaka de Souza. One of the sharpest, most accurate strikers we have ever seen. The Dragon has returned to take his kingdom back. I want to thank all the fans that support me and the good times and the bad times. I give my best on this octagon. Vitor Belfort. A night to celebrate Brazilian mixed martial arts. And where better to do it but here in Rio tonight. Get ready, Brazil! Brazil.